see you soon. I don't know what to make of that. <laughs> I mean, you know, I mean, I've said it till I'm blue in the face. I'll say it one last time, then I'm going to get a hot dog. You know, I didn't know there was a strike. I had no word from SAG in my London home that there was a strike. Nobody knows what SAG is in England. We have a different union. It's called Equity. And my advertising agency in New York was very remiss in not telling me that there was a strike. But the fact remains, they didn't. I didn't know. And I had no idea I was crossing a picket line when I did the commercial. If I'd known, I wouldn't have done it. But I didn't know. You can't rewrite history. You can't put back the clock. There's simply nothing I can do. I've explained the situation. The powers that be at SAG completely understand and accepted a donation from me. I'm not quite sure about these guys. Maybe, I don't know. It's a little maybe confusing to me. Maybe it's a real devilish thing. Maybe it'll... Tell me I about don't know. Maybe you want to be on TV. I don't know. Tell me it's about weird. one of your more devilish moments. Golly, I don't know. I'm so well behaved nowadays. I don't think I have any. Okay, are you more you know, All I don't know is that I'm getting into big trouble for holding out the premiere by probably 45 minutes. I tried to behave. I fall by the wayside from time to time, but I definitely tried. I don't know, it is kind of nice. You know, traditionally, Americans always cast Brits. Right. Bad guys. Exactly. We never know why, but they kind of go around. Well, they kind of do. Glory outfit. Glory outfit. It's all Versace. Yeah. Yeah. 